Hi there, my name is Susan Lupek and I'm a senior lecturer here at Macquarie University in the History and Archaeology Department. I am the course director of the Bachelor of Archaeology program as well as co-director of a project, an archaeological project that I run in Greece. Uh, it's called the Parahora Peninsula Archaeological Project. My name is Dr Julia Hamilton and I'm an Egyptologist and I work here at Macquarie University. I really specialize in the language and culture of ancient Egypt particularly of what we call the Old Kingdom. So part of my work involves studying the inscriptions and language and buildings of ancient Egyptian people from this very, very ancient culture. And that's also what I teach here at Macquarie University. I think the favorite thing about the job that I have here at Macquarie University is teaching, actually, and I teach Egyptian language, which I really, really enjoy. But one of the things that I find really fascinating about being an Egyptologist is it's sort of like being a little bit of a detective of the ancient world, piecing together all of these little puzzle pieces, um, unlocking clues and, and decoding inscriptions. That's what I get to do in my every day when I'm teaching, but it's also part of my research. Archaeology has changed a great deal. In a sense, it's changed a lot. In a sense, it hasn't changed that much. We're still trying to understand the past cultures, but now the focus in the past, the focus was very often on getting out the beautiful objects. When we're talking about excavating, well, we still get down there with a trowel and a dustpan and broom, and we use, you know, toothbrushes to excavate human remains. But, you know, on the other hand, we are now using the geophysical kind of like ways to figure out where we want to excavate first. We get more out of it because we're able to sort of predict, like we can understand things before we start digging and then we can do more targeted digging. I'd really like to see the use of non-invasive technologies in archaeological work in the future. I think this is really, really important, especially because archaeology in the past was incredibly destructive. I think I'm also really excited about work in the future that really takes seriously the problem of climate change, such an important problem in the modern world, but also a really important problem in the ancient world, especially in Egypt. Hey guys, I want you guys to have fun with this. I'm so looking forward to hearing and seeing what you come up with. That's going to be super thrilling for me. So get into it, go for it and have fun.